So after she watches it, the phone rings and she burns her hand and then she has a mark on her hand. And in trailer one, it very clearly gives away what the mark means. This mark on your hand. It says rebirth. But somehow the entire film treats it as though it's a twist at the end. Like it's supposed to be some massive scary revelation that it says rebirth. And the end of the movie is her basically getting possessed by Samara. Like this whole scene in the bathroom is literally the end of the movie. Come to think of it, this is one of the most dishonest trailers for a film I've ever seen in my entire life. Like whoever edited the trailer clearly understood that pointing attention to whatever day it is is kind of an integral part to the story, or at least it should be. Does the way that this is edited not kind of imply that the film would be doing something similar? This whole scene with the email chain also never really happens. It's kind of something that happens at the end of the film, and it's implied that the video is sent to a bunch of other people. But the trailer implies that that was how the plot was set up? Like, this shot's not in the movie. This never happens in the movie. This never happens in the movie. This part doesn't happen in the movie. And this never happens in the movie either! What the hell, man? Was I just so bored and uninvested that I forgot that these things even happened? I know for a fucking fact that this shit never happened because I was kind of waiting for it to happen. 